What's up, YouTube? It's Chris, aka Mr. Ramon. Let me see if I can get that right. There you go. Uh, this is for uh, for Jesse's contest. This is a video response. Uh, Jesse, aka Midnight Crawler. He's doing a, uh, a special contest where he's giving away a couple, you know, one or you know, you know, some really cool DVDs. First off, Jesse, congrats for the 200 subs. It's a fucking milestone, you know. You deserve it. You deserve a lot more. I'm, uh, I'm happy. I've been checking out your channel for a while. Your videos are always fantastic, and you know, you, you really deserve it. It was each, every single one of them. Um, the contest was to pick out your f your two favorite horror artwork. Well, the problem is I don't the ones that the DVDs that I have from some of the 80s and 90s, the artworks were never great. They were just never saying anything to me. You know, Candle Holocaust had the skull, and, you know, Dead Alive had uh, the scene where, you know, he, he's got the lawnmower in hand and just going away at the, at the zombies. Fucking love that scene. But, um, I went with a couple of classic horrors that I'm big fans of. I've always loved watching. Just, just great, great films. First one, I remember seeing this in 83 and just telling my dad, you know, at the video store, I want to watch it, I want to watch it, I want to watch it. He was like, are you sure? Like, yeah. It's like, it looks great. Um, it's called The Thing. Uh, what I loved so bad it was, it was just, you didn't know what it was about. The, just the personification of what it could be. You know, it just, whatever could just come out of that area. You know, I always liked the, the artwork of it. The movie alone is just one of my favorite Carpenter films. I mean, there's so many Carpenter films, that, but you know the music, the story, and you know Kurt Russell, just the quintessential Carpenter hero. Always had a great time. Yeah, so that's that's the first one. Next one. This one took me forever. I was on. I, I got it 15 years ago, and I was, it took me maybe about two years to finally track a copy down, and I was always just, always had a fun time with it. Uh, some people, some people call it a horror, I just call it a comedy, I love it, you know, it is Blood Diner. Something about this, that little place, and, you know, it says come and eat where you're going to die. You know, the moonlit night, you know, the, the stabbing knife, it just looks it's great. Um, it's an homage to, you know, Lewis's Blood Feast. Uh, and truthfully, I saw this before I saw Blood Feast, and I gotta say, I, I like Blood Diner, I'm sorry. It was, you know, this film had everything. Cannibalism, vomiting, uh, a vegetarian diner. Oh, and a smart-ass puppet. It was just such a fucking asshole. <laughs> oh. God, I, I love this film. I, I just cherish it. And, you know, I'm, I could never give this away. This is just something... You can always cherish, and and it's amazing. So yeah, those are my two two picks for the horror work contest. Hope they're okay. Um, you know, and again, man, here's to 200 more subs. You have yourself a great time. Um, rate, comment, subscribe, and don't drink the Kool-Aid. La 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 la. Bye. If you like the